Hi, this is Jim Myrick with the Myrick and Young team with Keller Williams Realty. And we're going to do a little bit of a wrap up on August 2012 for the Santa Clara County housing inventory. So I got a little bit of a theme of the elections and I'm going to make two predictions here. The elections are either going to negatively impact the real estate market or positively impact the real estate market. Is that fair to say? Yeah. I always love when people start talking about politics, especially at this time, it's kind of exciting. And, and the, the real answer is we just don't really know. Uh, what we do know is that normally during this time, right before elections, there's nothing real drastic happening in the regulatory part of real estate because no one really wants to be judged or uh, being that thrown into the election process. So let's talk about the inventory. Right now, single family units are about 1,225 and condominiums are 248, which is crazy low. The, you have, um, compared to this time last year, is about 60% off. If not in some, some condominium areas, it's even worse than that. The uh, uh, single family units that actually closed this month was 1,099 compared to 1,028 last year. Now let's think about that. So our inventory is super low, but our, our closed sales are up. It's up 7.5% for single family units and it's up 5.5% for condos. Well, that's kind of interesting. What's happening in the background? Well, what's going on, let, let's maybe throw one little um, uh, possibility in there. We have pending sales of single family units, about 2,228 homes that are currently pending and ready to close transaction. However, 1,103 of those are short sales. Okay, so 49% of the market is in a in possibly closing, possibly not. Now, short sales have a higher chance of closing nowadays if you have the right agent who understands the short sale process. However, we know statistically speaking that 57% of the transactions close with a second buyer. So let's think about that. The 540 units of that 1,103 will not close with the current buyer that's in escrow. Well, there's a whole other inventory in there that we should be looking at. Um, also, uh, condominiums, are, uh, the percentage is even higher. 964 pending condominiums in the market, and of those pendings, 556 of them are short sales. So that means 58% of those uh, properties may or may not close with that. Uh, well, 58% of that is short sales, and 322 of those units will probably not close with the current buyer that's in escrow. So those are things to think about. So if you have any questions and uh, some of these ideas on where these hidden inventories are, uh, give us a call over at the Myrick and Young team. You see all our, our information down at the bottom. Either email us or send us uh, um, or, or call us on, on the, uh, the general line.